So I want to do a podcast, and I'm not too sure how to do it, but I don't really care. You know, I grew up listening to like Howard Stern before he was a politically correct piece of shit. You know, back in the days when Artie Lang was doing heroin on the show and passing out, you know, the good old days. So I decided, you know, why can't I do that? I also decided that there's lots of great, great, great artists in my area that I would love to talk to and, you know, see what inspired them to get to where they are, you know, see if it's any, if it's similar to myself as I write, I make songs, I, I do it all. I'm a, I'm the poorest entrepreneur you'll ever meet. So I decided, you know, why not get the shit going do some interviews with some interesting people. I don't know, maybe talk shit about the current state of the world, you know, how it's pretty much nearing the end. You know, we're all going to die pretty soon. At least I think so. And I'm not even talking about the Donald Trump shit. I'm talking about how horrible hip hop has become. How fucking horrible hip hop has become. I listen to you know, some serious XM channels, just bad song after bad song, you know, a song like Black Beatles is number one, you know, if the guy's like, I got my John then and then is, you know, shut the fuck up, you know, Gucci Mane looks like a retarded Urkel, you know, it's fucking retarded, all of it, it makes me really sick, actually, you know, you know, I'm a guy who likes Tupac, you know, Tupac would not be down for this shit. And, you know, quite frankly, if he was alive and he was, I'd fucking hate Tupac. And it pains me to say that, but that's the truth. Anyways, uh, I just wanted to give a little preview. I'm going to try to start doing this podcast very soon. Just got to figure out how to properly interview people for the best sound quality possible. As you can hear now, this sound quality isn't, you know, isn't what it should be. But who gives a fuck, right? So I decided I have a wish list of people I'd like to interview. You know, there's some great local artists in my area. You know, Tyler B is a guy I would love to interview. If you don't know Tyler B, look him up. The Imagination of Tyler B EP. And soon to come out, the Imagination of Tyler B EP 2. And I'm proud to say I'm on both those fucking things. You know, I fucking killed it. You know, Tyler's just a great guy to work with. You know, he's very understanding. He appreciates lyricism. You know, he has his own unique voice. No one sounds like him. You know, and then there's guys like Killa Kella, who I've known for, I don't know, three, four years now. I've done two songs with him. One was called Danger to Myself. The other called Today is the Day, along with him and Just Incredible, who's another artist I'd love to talk to. And uh, soon to be another one, as he will be appearing on my next mixtape. Then there's guys like Massacre, who's coming back into the industry. You know, guys who are slowly making it, like Young Stitch and Peter Jackson. Then there's Jay Hen and fucking Escapade and Zays and Milestone and Jadon. You know, there's so many. I, I... I, it's impossible to name them all. And if I didn't name you, I'm sorry, but, you know, fucking deal with it, you know, you fucking baby. So, uh, yeah, this is what I want to do now. You know, I'm basically going to be just a college student soon, so I need something to do when I'm not, when I'm not studying. <laughs> like that's going to fucking happen. I've never studied a day in my life and I'm an honor student who gives a shit. I'm smart as fuck. You know, doing this with no money is hard. You know, people might expect to get paid. You know, they expect to get paid for everything because everybody thinks they're fucking Dr. Dre out here. But I don't care. You know, anyone who wants to just do a free interview, try to spread the word, you know, maybe give me some of your music to play during the podcast. If not, whatever. You can spit a freestyle. You can do whatever you want. And this isn't only for rappers, by the way. I'm looking for you know, guitarists, drummers, poets, authors, screenwriters, you know, porn stars, anything, anything. 
And uh, speaking of porn stars, I would love to do that, you know. Maybe I could actually get laid for once. <laughs> that would be pretty fun, you know. It's been a while. You know, my I have blue balls. <laughs> my balls are so blue that they're crying. They're singing Robert Johnson songs. You know, it's fucking awful. So anyways, this was just a little preview. I just wanted to kind of address what I wanted to talk about, you know, in the upcoming podcast. You know, and something I'm really going to be talking about is political correctness, though. I hate political correctness. I love dirty, offensive jokes on race, religion, everything. I don't give a fuck. I'm not racist. I just think some of the stereotypes can be made fun of. You know, and I don't agree with the stereotypes. However, there's some good fucking jokes about them. <laughs> you know, I also want to talk about Melania Trump, the very first first lady who have I have ever seen naked. You know, and to be honest, you know, you cut out that sour face and that's fuck. You know, there's no way she could love Donald Trump. There's no fucking way she could love Donald Trump. He is just, he's just this disgusting old piece of shit who happens to have a lot of money. And to me, that's the reason she's with him. Um, when you look at her interviews over the past few years, it's the same fucking thing over and over again. Like she's following a script. It's kind of disgusting, but you know what? She has a nice snatch. So there. <laughs> You know, so uh, I hope people will eventually tune in when I get this fucking shit going. And, uh, you know, that's all I want to say, really. I just want to try to do something for my local community and all the artists involved in it. And I want to promote myself, obviously, because I'm a fucking egomaniac. But I also want to listen to new music, find new people to collaborate with. And just have fun. Have, having fun is the major thing here. So, yeah, that's what I would love to do. This is Mr. Hookah, and I am out. <laughs>